If you recall, I was saying that computerized cognitive behavior therapy is as effective as face-to-face uh, -face psychotherapy. And what they did was they did what's called a meta-analysis. They looked at uh, hundreds of research papers which have compared these things, and they ended up with like 1,418 patients who'd gone through one or the other. And it turns out that the outcomes are the same. Panic, anxiety, depression, stress, and even fibromyalgia uh, and chronic fatigue, when they have outcomes, they're the same for computerized as face-to-face. -face. You recall that in the previous video, I said that you need to be engaged with the problem. You need to, in a sense, interrogate the problem. What is, what is your nature, Mr. Problem? What is, what is it that you're telling me? What is it that you're making me do? What does it mean? Why do I have this problem? And what can I do about it? Okay, so it's engagement. That's why I asked you to send me questions. The second part, of course, is once you engage with a problem, you've got to get some knowledge about the problem. Now, there are different, in a sense, knowledge bases about psychological problems, but the one that we're using uh, on this page and in general in my practice is CBT, Cognitive Behaviour Therapy, because it's probably the most effective, but it's also dead easy to understand and it's very easy to apply. And over the years, I've created many CBT tools that you can use walking around the street. You can be using one of the tools and it will help you to feel better. So you've got to get knowledge and that's where CBT comes in. You can acquire the CBT knowledge to apply to your problem and in so doing you can minimize your problem. And if you keep minimizing it, eventually it will disappear. And the way it works out is this. You may have heard me say this before. Your psychological problem just sort of evaporates, right? So that you forget about it. So I sometimes say to people, uh, so what's been happening this week? And they go, oh, yeah, I forgot to be anxious. I forgot to have the problem because their mind is somewhere else and the problem has been minimized through application of tools and processes to be so small that it no longer enters consciousness. So acquire knowledge of how to work with your problem. And from my point of view, that's what we, we get inside the drpurvis.online courses. Don't forget to send me a question if you want to have help to get started in understanding what your problem is and then how to get some knowledge that will start to minimize it in your life. And tomorrow I will send you the last part of the process of helping you to move forward from panic, anxiety, depression, stress, or whatever problem it is that you struggle with.